So what's up everybody, I'm back today with a brand new um, spin tires video. So today we're taking a look at a 2017 Ford F450, another mod by CCS. This truck looks amazing, um, I haven't done anything with it, I literally just started up the game and brought the mod in and this truck really does look awesome. I like the bumper, the two bumpers on it, well the front bumper and the rear bumper they look awesome uh, it says platinum super duty four-wheel drive yep obviously very nicely <laughs> lifted um, I really like the new f-150 and 250 and 350 and 450 look I really like the new Ford look really um, so I guess since I, I noticed we have a trailer here I don't want to check it out Okay, so that's what I thought. So what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to go ahead and run this truck without the trailer first. And by the way, we're on the volcano map. So we're going to run this truck without the trailer and then we'll come back and get it. I think we're on the volcano map. I think that's what I chose. Eh, whatever. But this truck, I, I noticed, this truck is one, a monster. This thing's plowing through this water like nothing's even there. Um, and it's really fast <laughs> so this truck holds 180 liters of fuel and has 400 damage points so um, I don't know what the trailer does I don't know if it hauls logs or you can put another vehicle on it or what but um, I'm, I'm sure it's probably logs but either way, this truck would be awesome for exploring. So, um, I noticed I did hit one tree limb, or down tree that gave us a bunch of damage. But this, otherwise, if you go slow, it just goes over everything. It's like what mud? It doesn't even care that there's mud there. This lift kit brings you or takes you right over all the rocks. Um, these uh, massive beefy mud tires, off-road tires, are perfect. This truck, the suspension, I noticed the suspension is really, really good. This truck's really bouncing around. I really like how, um, the work that CCS put into this mod. I don't know, I haven't actually seen what the new F450 looks like or the I, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure I have, but apparently I can't remember. But I noticed these little uh, uh, side things here for the dually wheels. They're kind of boxy. I, I guess Ford has it like that. I'm not complaining. It's just a little boxy look. Otherwise, the truck looks great. I just thought I'd point that out. I still think the truck looks good. So, it's a, it's a nice truck. So. Um, bogging down a little bit. We're gonna leave it in automatic for now. May have to put this in low. Yeah, let's put it in low. Come on, shift. Oh, that's high. Whoops. Oh, all-wheel drive might help. We're just bogging down. I think we're gonna try and. Um. won't go in reverse. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Just me being stupid. Okay. By the way, I wonder... Okay, there's two up front and one in the back winch points. Okay, so let's see if we can slap this monster in high. Nope, stall it. Let's back up, get a little more of a run up. I don't think we're going to be able to get it in high right here. I think we're going to avoid that little place right there. And we're just going to try and go up around it. Huh. Maybe we'll take this. I really hope it's just not the truck that's not it's not able to do this. I feel like it should be able to. Um, 
it's got big beefy tires big off-road tires but it might be just because it's muddy and it's a really steep incline okay the truck won't go in reverse have to put it in reverse ourselves I guess huh Yeah, the truck won't go in reverse. Well, there we go. Okay, well that's kind of it's kind of weird, but I mean it still works. Otherwise, it still works great. Let's kind of try and let's, okay, just kind of a side view. It's not bad. Um, the Zombie Edition F one fifty, I think it was. I it had the same. Uh, camera. I really wish it had an interior camera because this truck would be awesome with an interior camera. Okay, now this is more like it. Okay, it shifted. Nope, not in reverse, not in reverse, not in reverse. <laughs> oh geez, we're right on damage. So, I think it was just that spot on the mountain. I really hope it was just that spot because the truck seems like in low gear it will climb it it just struggles a little bit this thing's rolling coal awesome come on dig in don't go sideways I really want to make it up this mountain in this F450 just hope it doesn't roll over or take that tree out. I wonder if I can winch up there. There we go. I think we'll just test out the winch. Now let's just do this. Oh, geez. Sitting on three wheels right now. Just kind of do this little trick. Uh oh. Well, that little trick backfired. <laughs> oh, let's just go ahead and release the winch. Um, okay, well, we almost got caught on the tree. I really. I bet with a little bit more time and a little bit more work, we could get this truck up the mountain. But I don't think it's worth it for the video. That is a really steep volcano. So, okay, well, I broke the truck. <laughs> I was gonna take it, oh yeah, that's that's a little messed up. So I was gonna take it over there, but apparently it's broke. So, let's take it back over to the garage and we'll get the trailer, because I almost forgot, actually. So, let's go ahead and get this trailer install. Ah, oh, position it properly. Uvi, you should have this fixed by now. This is annoying. Come on. This isn't even a very big trailer. Oh. That is a good sized trailer. See if we can do it here. There we go. Okay, it is a flatbed. I'm not too sure if it holds like lumber. It may just hold lumber. Um, I don't know. Whoops! Didn't mean to hit that. Um, park trailer. Oh, it holds fuel. It might just hold lumber. Does it have ramps on the back? Let's see. Well, that is a huge trailer. Okay, so I guess the ramps don't go up and down. It doesn't have any like buttons for them. But I kind of want to put something on this trailer. I think we'll just back up to this little hill right here. And We'll load. Um, 
Load that little truck. Okay, it won't go in reverse again. Yeah, there's something up with this truck. It doesn't want to go in reverse all the time. Yeah, it's not wanting to go in reverse. Well, let's switch over to B666. Okay, now it's in reverse. I'm not even pressing reverse and it's going in reverse. Okay. I think we may just use this truck to pull the other one over closer to the hill. I think we might just do that because I really want to put this truck on the trailer. Well, actually, that ramp might be low enough. While we were in that truck, it looked... Oh, yeah, we should have... Uh, it didn't look that low to the ground for some reason. It may have just been me. Let's uh, just go ahead and drive up on here. I was going to try and use the interior, well, like, above the cab camera. But I don't think that's going to work out for us. Guess we're good on the other side. I think we're off the trailer on the other side. No, we're right on. Awesome. There we go. Let's uh, just center it on the axles. And we will uh, parking brake on. There we go. Now let's change trucks. Perfect. Start this monster up. Now let's go. Oh, that thing's bouncing around. This truck is really working. Can't really see where we're going because I'm trying to watch the truck on the back. But this truck is amazing. I don't know if this trailer would haul logs at all. And I don't know. I don't really... I don't, I'm not going to test it. Because this trailer will haul this massive truck. Well, this truck will pull, pull the trailer, which will then haul that massive truck on the trailer. And you can fit trucks and trailers on there. This trailer is long enough for that. So, I think this truck's amazing. I don't know why it doesn't want to go in reverse sometimes. Uh... I don't know if it's just me or if it is the actual truck itself or the mod itself but I mean it is sort of annoying but yeah I, I don't know it, it, it's sort of annoying but the truck is still so nice that I don't want to just say this truck sucks because it can't go in reverse this truck doesn't suck it's pulling this massive um, we are stuck but it's pulling this massive trailer off-road with that big truck on the back on the trailer so I'd say it's doing a pretty good job okay well now it won't turn well whatever <laughs> this truck is awesome this is a uh, if there weren't all those trees there be a great thumbnail there we go perfect so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys are new to the channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button for more content like this probably some more CCS mods well for sure some more CCS mods he makes amazing mods um, they're all really good quality uh, as you can see right there so once again if you guys are new to the channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button show this truck some love and hit that like button down below if you guys liked it so I will see you guys later.